She says, what is the Janaza procedures for a stillborn baby? There is a general consensus between the scholars that once a child or a baby is born, if he or she is born alive, then they died innocently, then we must do the following. The following ahkam we, uh, will be required to be fulfilled. Number one, uh, the tawseel, the ghusl, or washing the body of the baby, like an adult exactly, then the coffin, and offering salatul janazah. And also it will be recommended to give him or her a name, even though they are already dead, and offer the aqiqah on behalf of them. But with regards to if the baby was born dead, there is a khilaf or a difference of opinions. Uh, the one which is chosen by Imam Ahmad and others, may Allah have mercy on them, is that since the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said that the soul or a ruh will be breathed into the fetus after four months, then if the fetus has spent four months or more and died afterward, so even if the child is born dead, then it is recommended and it is legitimate to do the previous ahkam exactly as if the fetus or the, uh, the incomplete baby uh, was born dead. Of the ghusl, the coffin, the janazah, the offering salatul janazah or the funeral prayer, giving a name and the aqiqah, of course. What do we say when we offer salatul janazah for a child, especially those who go to offer Umrah or Hajj, the here always the Imam is announcing or the Mu'adhin Salatul Janazati ala tifli yarhamukum Allah so he declares whether it's a male or a female an adult or a child in the case of an adult a male or a female we use the right pronoun to pray for them may Allah have mercy on them may Allah take them to paradise may Allah save them from the torment of the grave etc in the case of the child, we pray for their parents. Allahumma ghfir li walidayhi warhamhuma. Because a child is innocent, did not commit any sins. So why would we say, Allahumma ghfir lahu warham? Why would we say, oh Allah, forgive him his sins or her sins? They are pure, they are sinless. So we will pray for their parents. Also because the parents bore the big calamity patiently. Hopefully, we pray for them as well.